so we landed in London. Now we are headed towards British Airways, like their little area. We don't know the gate and stuff yet, but we're just going to go there and kind of chill out. But Dad slept five hours. I'm just really tired. Okay, so we made it through security, so now all we have to do is wait to board, really. So I think we're gonna get some food and then just chill. There's like stores and stuff around here, but I think we're really hungry, so. Guys, look at this Dolby. <laughs> so now we're going to head to our gate. Okay guys, we just landed in Venice and now we are at the baggage claim getting our bags. Praying that they came in, so we'll see. After all these months, I it can end now. It is about, I don't know, a little bit more than a week later that we are filming this and we just wanted to say thank you for following us along in this whole journey in that we finally are, you know, together now in the house. We are. Um, we just want to say also that like this is not a typical moving process, like I don't want people to see this and, you know, feel like that this is going to happen to them because it's very rare. Um, but Jordan and I did try our best to kind of stay positive throughout this whole thing um, Because you know, obviously it was really hard to try to keep a positive mind when it came down to this um, But like I said, we are finally together now and we are in the house. We are trying to get everything situated um, There's been a few kickbacks that we've had here in the house, but we're figuring it out so as of right now, um, my grandpa's still with us, but he will be here until next week and then he's going back home. And then after that, it'll be just us and we're gonna try to get Thor over here as soon as we can. So we're still working on that. But other than that, it is just a fact of unpacking things right now and organizing, which Jordan has already done a great job getting stuff unpacked and organizing things mm -hmm. already. Um, but yeah, Jordan- had the whole entire house done before you got here? Yeah, so Jordan has been going to work and everything just like normal and um, you know, we've just been chilling out here. We've done a lot of sightseeing. Um, we've done a lot of traveling already. Not to like far places, but we've been around a lot. We um, did a few um, shopping type situations where we went to Ikea and grocery shopping and stuff. So we just want to say thank you because um, we also got a very overwhelming, what do I say? Like a like support? Uh, yeah. Like support I, I've had a lot of people reach out to me um, when I finally got here and um, I did not expect a lot of people to be following like everything. I just kind of do this just from my own um, perspective, but I didn't know that a lot of people watch this. So anyways, we just want to come on here and say thank you in that um, now we're going to be doing a lot of Italy content, which is really exciting and a lot of um, like um, I want to do like more cleaning stuff and you know, I want to try to make YouTube a little bit more of a priority in my life just to kind of like, you know, make it as a hobby. So we just really appreciate everybody coming and all the kind words that they've that everyone like has said to us. Um, so yeah. I just want to say thank you for especially everyone who watches Ashlyn's channel and who, you know, direct message her on Instagram and Facebook and stuff like mm -hmm. that because she'll tell me like, oh, this person I didn't even know that was on Instagram, you know, they, they responded, you know, showing how much they support. Um, you know support us and watch our videos and stuff like that so mm -hmm. i just want to say thank you as well for supporting her um i'm more of like an independent person so i'm glad that she had the overwhelming support <laughs> back in the states yeah it was hard it was very hard for both of us so i just want to say thank you and yeah uh, but um yeah we're just excited that jordan's gonna be finally back in the vlogs and that this is finally over and that obviously this isn't the worst long distance situation that anyone has ever been in but it is um definitely one for the books i feel like so we hope that y'all enjoyed this journey thanks for sticking around and we hope that you subscribe to continue our journey in italy together bye guys bye